Welcome to Area DMG. Welcome back to Area DMG. I'm your host, Phil Wesley, the Mile High Mouth. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, and, uh, you know, all that stuff with the video. Anywho, we're going to unbox what was um, in the thumbnail. But first, I'm going to do a little bit of explaining about it. This is Metro Redux. Metro Redux for Nintendo Switch is Metro 2033 and Metro Last Light 2033. Sorry, Redux. It's the Redux versions of those in one game card on the Nintendo Switch. Now, Deep Silver, the people who published this, put out a special edition of it. The thing is, the special edition stuff isn't included with this unless you pre-ordered it. And then they did not send GameStop all the pre-order stuff. So, here's what you have here. Here's the game card, which mm, tastes like sadness. I mean, this is really, this is the cover art that you get. It's kind of bad. This right here, eh, not so good. But this, this special edition actually has some more stuff. Here's what's in it. A um, game case sleeve, alternate artwork inlay, four art cards, a fold-out poster, and a pin badge set. So let's go ahead and take that out for a second. You see, this is the thing that came with it if you special ordered it from GameStop, but that didn't come out when it came out. They got this in their packaging like a little bit later, which was weird, to be honest. It's like, oh, I already picked up my pre-order. Anywho, whoa, let me go ahead and open this up real quick. This is the poster. It appears to be double-sided. Let's go ahead and take a look at that. Ooh, oh no. Ooh, I ripped the poster. I feel bad. Oh boy. It's a huge poster. Oh, that ripped though. Well, if I were to frame it or anything, I would just put something over that. It's got re Redux on one side and uh, Last Light. They're both Redux. There's Last Light on one side and then uh, um, 2033 on the other. So a poster. Ooh boy. And let's see what else is in here. You got an alternate insert for Metro Redux. Ooh, this is actually better. Let's take a look at that. It doesn't have the logo on it, but let's take a look here. But it does look better. And the idea is you can just pop this into the sleeve. That's a special edition, and then it has um, a couple pins. Let's take a look at those. They're pretty heavy pins, too. Heavy duty. And then three art cards. Metro 2333. Another um, Metro Last Light. Last Light. And 2033. This one and that. So, this is what came with it, or rather, came with it, but didn't show up with it. And that would be, well, that would be the, um, the slipcover, the alternate art, the pins, and then the, um, art cards, and then the poster. That's what technically is supposed to come with Metro Redux if you purchased it from GameStop as a pre-order. So, there you go, that's, uh, that's that. One thing about Metro Redux, which I really like, is that it's got both games on the same card with no day one patch or download, which to me is just fantastic. Now, I know there's a couple small issues here and there. Like, I, I know there's a couple frame drops here and there, but for the most part, Metro Redux on the Switch is really well ported. It's really well done. And if there's really anything they could improve on, I guess they could do that later on with a patch, but the way they they created this, you don't need a patch. There was never a patch. It just, everything's on the game card. You just pop it in and play, which is pretty sweet. And I really enjoy it. It's actually a pretty good um, first-person shooter. If you're a fan of games like Doom or Wolfenstein 2, or Wolfenstein Youngbloods, or the upcoming Doom Eternal, or some of the other first-person shooters that are on the Switch, and you want one that's a little bit more story-driven, 
and you're like, yeah, I want a story-driven shooter, and I want, well, Metro Redux is here for that. And, yeah, until we get something like Bioshock on the Switch, this is kind of like pretty close in terms of like, you know, very story driven. So yeah, let me know in the comments below. Have you played Metro um, 2033 or Metro 2033 Last Light? Let me know in the comments below. Hit that thumbs up and the share button and the subscribe button. Ring that little bell so you're notified whenever we have a brand new video here on Area DMG. And until the next video comes out, you are now caught up. Morning, Maya.